Okay, so we'll just load the block box onto this. And uh, we have a 512 gig card SDXC. Just gonna switch it on, there we go. Go to the menu and change this font. And uh, we have, um, as you can see, we have changed the font to bold uh, so I can see a bit easier and video it. So files, click on that. These are basically, I've arranged them in this way. So they are folders and uh, I've just created a folder called playlist and then added all of these into there and as you can see they're a mixture of all different music I believe uh, I'm not put much on there but if I can show you go to systems oops sorry systems and that's the battery life which is pretty good since oops sorry get back here so since uh, I haven't changed the existing battery, it's still the slim battery in the 7th gen um, and it charges very quickly and it holds uh, continuous play without sort of changing any of the settings for over 24 hours it will just play, uh, freeze 435 gig uh, and, uh, 435 gig uh, and uh, as you can see after formatting 512 GB we have 477 was our, um, our um, oops, sorry. I press the select button on the disk so it's now scanning but, uh, it's going to take a little while oh, God. sorry about that Basically, opening this up did uh, I did do a little bit of damage, as you can see. Seventh gen is difficult to open. I've left it a little bit open. I haven't closed it completely because I'm going to change the front and the back case uh, available for you know quite a cheap price. So I think it's about a tenner for front, tenner for the back. Anyway, going back to the menu, if I go back, here we are, basically, uh, you can set the fade, playback settings, it's brilliant, I think, uh, forget iTunes, I mean, this can, you can leave this on playing, uh, switch it to what they call the crossfade mode, and in that, you have many other different options of that you can see and uh, basically it just keep playing uh, oh, for over 24 hours uh, on one battery charge uh, as I say if the battery is good and basically that's that um, any questions uh, please put them on but I followed this I bought the card from iFlash and uh, cards in there and um, I mess around a little bit. I can switch it to iTunes. I can, I can go to dual mode, so I can go to iTunes when I want, and I can go come back to this. So I have to go to iTunes to transfer the tunes across. It's only not through iTunes, but through the Windows Explorer. Uh, for some reason, it'll only see the um, iPod. Um, Rockbox system when you set it to iTunes, but then when you come back of uh, out of Apple out of iTunes, it's straightforward. And then you whatever you transferred across, you will then see here in the file section. And as you can see, there is and it moves. You know, it's very responsive, very fast. Uh, and uh, there you go. You can then add to the current playlist insert there and it's inserted and if I go back and press now playing this is what it's playing 
Uh, you can change all of these themes, the fonts, there are so many there on the website, it's uh, very quickly done. Um, I'm really happy, uh, and it's a lot easier to manage. That's great, thank you very much for watching.